Hello everyone, welcome back to part 25 of The Sims 3 World and Island Adventures. So, we are back home in Isla Paradiso, where Summer is talking to her best mermaid friend, the best mermaid friend she has. And I did play a little bit off camera, more or less just trying to get some more money and building their friendships. So yeah, we're best friends with Maya. It took forever to get that show the secret island thing. So Maya says, follow me and I will show you the way to the mermaid's secret island. I am so, so excited. I never saw this island before. <laughs> and it took forever to get that interaction. I seriously spent a whole, whole bunch of days just trying to befriend the mermaid. <laughs> just trying to get that interaction to pop up. Come on, Maya, you are supposed to be showing us the way. Apparently, Summer knows how to get there. You guys are going to swim the whole way there. How far do you have to go? Okay, the mermaid grotto is over here. So, yeah, I think they have a long ways to go. <laughs> it's so, so, so pathetic. <laughs> you guys should take a boat. But maybe they can't get there by boat. Maybe they can only get there by swimming. Okay, so yeah, I was playing a little bit off camera and Summer got a promotion. We sold all of her photos, well, most of them. And now she is Titan of Timelessness. How fancy. <laughs> and we are so, so close to earning our next promotion. But yeah, so I also got Summer to consign a lot of these guys' treasures. Not everything, just the jewels, the gems, some of the stuff we didn't really need. So yeah, we have quite a bit of money now which is really, really, really cool. And it is going to take her forever to get there. So we're going to go back home first. And I think I'm going to accept a few gifts because I love it when I get gifts in my mailbox. Actually, I need somebody to do this for me. Paul, how about you do this? He is currently scuba diving. He's actually down there with um, Triton, Triton King. <laughs> Here he is without his tail. <laughs> what a lousy mermaid, a tailless mermaid. But yeah, I think we're just going to go home and try to accept a few gifts. Summer is probably going to take the whole night probably the whole day to get there. So Paul is home and we're going to accept a few gifts. Okay, so we have a gift from Claudia Rocks. One, two, three. Thank you so much. I love getting these gifts. This is my first time actually opening a gift <laughs> in The Sims 3, so I am so, so excited. Thank you so much, Claudia. I really appreciate it. We got a lamp and I will try to use the gifts as much as I can. If it's something really, really random or super expensive, like a bowling alley or a big statue, I probably will sell it as we can use the money, but I will try to use the decor kind of items. So let's do a luxury care package. And thank you so much. Enjoy your gift.
Oh, this is so, so exciting. I never did the gift giving before. <laughs> I love it. Okay, we have another gift from Lynn VR. Hope you will enjoy it. Okay, we got a play table. Maybe she is predicting Paul and Summer's future with children. Wink, wink. <laughs> okay. How comes we can't do a luxury? I guess we'll do a surprise gift box. Thank you. I did enjoy it. Hope you enjoy yours too. That beeping in the background is my laundry machine. <laughs> I'm doing laundry as always. Yay, we got 500 simoleons. I love it. I do. I love it so, so much. We can definitely use the money. Let's do a comfort care package. Thanks, girly, for the money. Hope you get money too. Okay, more stuff from Claudia. Ooh, we can probably put that upstairs if we have enough room. Thanks for the lawn chair. Hope you enjoy your surprise gift box. <laughs> Oh, this is so much fun. I really love it when you guys send me gifts and stuff. I really do love it so, so much. Yay, more money. <laughs> I love the money. More stuff from Claudia. We'll do another comfort care. Thanks for the money. <laughs> too many money signs. That was just too crazy. <laughs> Okay, we got a plant. I can always use plants and stuff like that. Oh no, I have to wait. That really sucks. <laughs> I was so, so excited. Oh my God, we got so much money. I love it. And I have to wait, apparently. <laughs> oh, I want to read her thing. Try remaking a uh, summer... Okay, try remaking summer and the resort. Just keep trying. Yeah, the resort is definitely a work in progress. <laughs> okay, yay, that was so much fun. We got an art easel. I love it. Okay, that is so, so cool. So I'll see you guys when we get to the island. Okay, so I think, I think summer is approaching the island i'm assuming this is it is it the whole thing because that is a huge huge island but yeah thank you guys so much for the gifts i love them so much definitely going to try to use them so paul is sleeping until he has to go to work these guys' sleep schedules are going to be really really messed up <laughs> i had them up during the night sleeping through the day it's all a mess. <laughs> so we did get our resort profits. So that's pretty freaking cool. We got like 3,000. So we are making the money. We are beginning to make the money. <laughs> and I'm thinking about changing Summer's lifetime wish to the resort thing from Island Paradise because the problem with this one is that I want to sell the photographs. That way we can use the money for the resort and go further in our career. So I don't see us keeping really, really expensive photographs. This is an easy one to do because 
we were getting around 2,000 simoleons for each photo, so we could do this. But I'd rather use the money for our resort, for our vacation homes, for a house in Isla Paradiso, because eventually I do want to build these guys a home in Isla Paradiso. Was that not it? <laughs> Where are you going? Over here? Okay, so I think we are officially approaching the island. This better be the right island. <laughs> and I'm also thinking, because Summer has the pleasantly warm moodlet. Oh, we're here! Yay! This is so, so exciting. Oh my god. This fog is going to make my game like, like crazy. <laughs> But oh my god, we have another island. I love how Paul found the first island and now Summer found the second island. It's so cute. Oh, it's so exciting. Wow, it really made my game lag like crazy. <laughs> and so yeah, like what I was saying, uh, she has the pleasantly warm moodlet. So she enjoys the sun. Yet, she is a mermaid, so she has the drying up moodlet from the sun. So you see how these two moodlets kind of contradict each other. So that is why I'm thinking about changing her loves the heat to probably loves to swim. I think that would suit Summer better. So I think I'll, pro I'll probably do that once the leg stops. <laughs> I just think that would make more sense. And I usually don't cheat too much, but when it comes to the personality, I really, really don't mind cheating because, you know, like life, you are constantly changing. You as a person are constantly growing. You are changing your thoughts. You are changing some characteristics of you. So Summer, she used to love the sun, but now that she is a mermaid, she can't really be in the sun too much. But now she loves to swim. <laughs> so it's, it's all good. It's all perfect. Oh my god, here is our island. So we are on our own island. I think the leg is a little bit better. Summer has a suntan. How nice. And she is also drying up, so the sun sucks. <laughs> so I did change her loves the heat to loves to swim. And I also changed her lifetime wish to resort empire. So we have to own a five star resort and collect 40,000 simoleons in resort profit. So we're going to collect this. Okay, good. It counted. And apparently Summer's brother, Cameron, is throwing a swimwear party. So we might try to go to that. <laughs> She's so happy she has to sing now that she found her island. She is a siren. <laughs> She's going to seduce all of these men with her voice. But yeah, here is the island. I love all of these mermaid ruins stuff. It's so, so cool. It's so beautiful. It's so lush, so green. We have like a little beach over here. It's so freaking gorgeous. I'm not sure if there are any treasure chests. I did not see any, but either way, it's so freaking beautiful. And it is ours. We have more land over here. A little island over here. Oh, uh, it's so freaking pretty. Okay, so we own the sucky thing. <laughs> we kind of own the island, yet the only thing we really own is this little square here. I wanted to maybe try to build a home that goes over the water kind of deal. So it kind of sucks 
that we only have this little part of land here. So I'm a little bit unsure of where I do want to build their home eventually. I might use the first island Paul discovered, but I do love this island so, so much. It is really, 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 really pretty. So I'm a little bit indecisive. <laughs> okay, Summer. You do have to go home. You are drying up. Poor, poor girl, but I'm happy that you finally found an island. I have no idea where Maya is. <laughs> I think she ditched us. I think she did. Okay, so I'm going to get you to probably boat here. That way you can come home, make the bed. And we do have our bird from the last part. <laughs> I named him Sam, I think. Yeah, his name is Sam. So we're going to feed his food or fill his food dish, not feed his food dish. Paul is saving lives. We'll play with him and we'll teach him a few greetings. And we'll tend to our garden. But yeah, how cute is Sam? Playing with a little ball. <laughs> He's cute. So over here at our resort, we got some new reviews. We are now a four-star resort, so we're doing pretty perfect. Okay, no pool bar. What kind of luxury resort doesn't have a pool bar? I notice the pool bar is probably one of the more requested kind of things. This place is the best thing to happen. The kids' buffet looks so good. Someone call the health department. I don't think the food they served at the food stand was legal to serve. Uh, they're always complaining. At first, they were complaining that we did not have a food stand. Now that I got them one, they are complaining. Still, <laughs> it was so nice to be able to enjoy a meal in my room. So as you can see, we did get quite a few good reviews overall. We are four stars. And the only upgrades I did was adding in a food stand. For some reason, my plants aren't loading. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's starting to load. I added in a food stand and I accidentally put this the wrong way. <laughs> it's supposed to face the other way and I put in a hot tub. So I did do a few little, little upgrades, nothing too major. Apparently next on our list is probably to get a pool bar because everyone wants one. Okay, so let's do high quality for this and we'll do graveyard as well. And I think we are good. He is doing his job, so that's all I can ask. <laughs> okay, I do see someone here. Yep, the same old man. He always, always drowns. We can count on him. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. This boat. Oh my god, that is too freaking cute. I want this. Lazy Daisy. I have, have to have it. How can you not? It's too freaking cute. Okay, so I think Summer is at home. That's good. She's finally, finally home, and she is exhausted. I think Cameron's party is starting, but she does need to sleep. So I think I'm going to get her to fill Sam's food dish. Then she can come here and sleep for a little bit. Okay, I think the old man was putting on his swimwear, so... Hopefully, you'll soon drown. I'm counting on you. Oh, okay. Apparently, Paul was unrootable. Okay, we got a little bit more money. Um, So, I found this really, really awesome. <laughs> so, when Paul was scuba diving with Triton 
Kang, he asked for some mermatic kelp. So, we have mermatic kelp. <laughs> Paul won't be becoming a mermaid. He can't. Not while being on adventures. He'd die in a tomb. <laughs> it won't work for him. But, but, if these guys maybe have kids in the future, maybe we can have a mermaid baby. So we might save that for then. And I think I want to go back to the resort because I think <laughs> we should probably update or upgrade the resort towers. <laughs> I think we should do that. We have the extra money, so let's upgrade. Ooh, like magic. The sparkles. <laughs> and can we upgrade you? There we go. So we have a second story. <laughs> so it's looking a little bit nicer. This really does not match the modern look over here, but for now it works. I like it. Okay, so yay, the old man drowned. I can always rely on him. Wait, Paul, why are you at the house? Ugh, these sins, these sins. Silly sins. And Cameron's party is just about to start, so I think maybe we can sleep at his house. <laughs> we'll go over there. All right, I have to tell Summer to actually boat over there or else she will swim. <laughs> I got Summer figured out. Okay, he is determined to save him. <laughs> okay, where is he? Okay, he's over there. Hopefully you'll get to him in time. You did glitch, so I'm not sure if you'll make it or not. Paul is determined though. <laughs> and I love how fast Paul swims now. He swims like a pro. <laughs> Yay, we did it. Just in time. Okay, so I'm not really seeing anybody here, so... Maybe nobody came. How sad. <laughs> but I do want to spend some time with our baby brother, so we're going to ask him about his day. Ah, uh, he's excited that we showed up. <laughs> then we're going to ask him if we can spend the night. Because maybe we can hang out, have some quality time going on. Man, she is so dark. <laughs> I love her tan, though. She's so cute. Okay, so, um, should we, should we lie? <laughs> Compliment his home? Not really. Um, We'll talk about his technology degree, though. She's like, I'm so, so proud of you. You went to college. You're intelligent. You're working hard. So, so proud of you. Oh, let's, let's sing. Can we sing? Oh, she's too tired to sing. How can you be too tired to sing? Seriously. We'll hug him. It has been a long time since we saw him. So Summer is a little bit emotional. <laughs> Her baby brother is all grown up. 
Okay, so let's go use his shower. <laughs> We're going to mooch off her brother. I really wish his party was starting, though. That would be so nice. <laughs> and you can probably eat some kelp. We'll get Paul to talk a little bit with Cameron as well. Yeah, introduce yourself. Jeez. Oh, he's going to make up some food. Okay, Paul. Go woohoo with Summer. <laughs> she won't expect it. <laughs> he's like, do you want to get squeaky clean? Because I can arrange that for you. Okay, Paul is in an excellent, excellent mood, though. Carved up. You ate one of your pemmicans or whatever. Zip, zap, zoom. All of the unnecessary nutrients were stripped from the original dish and pressed into a muddy brick of delightful dried food. Carbtastic. <laughs> I should say that from now on. Carbtastic. I like it. Oh, he's being nice. That's cute. How about you talk to your mom for a little bit? I did extend the aging for elders, as well as everybody else, pretty much. What are you wearing, Summer? I did not give you that. I did not give you that. <laughs> I swear, Summer is so independent. She really does what she wants. <laughs> But yeah, so I did extend the aging because this Let's Play will be pretty, pretty long and there's a lot more I want to do with like Paul's parents and all of that. I don't want them to die so, so soon. Aw, he's singing to her after Ruhu. <laughs> so this is kind of cute. It's kind of like... Paul and Summer are kind of having a little stay at Summer's family's house. <laughs> kind of visiting the family, so apparently Chrissy really likes Paul then. She actually approves of Paul, I think. It's just Paul's parents who really, really need to come around. And hopefully they will. Sorry, Cameron, we took your bed. How is he behaving inappropriately? So, I think I'm going to be ending this part here. Chrissy, don't be mad at us. <laughs> Maybe she does not approve because her daughter is sharing the same bed with a guy. <laughs> That's probably it. She's like, Summer, that is so inappropriate. I'm going to keep the door open. That way no hanky-panky goes on <laughs> under my roof. But yeah, so I'll be talking to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys, and yeah, have an amazing day. Bye!